Hello everyone. So this time we will going to study kung paano kunin yung x intercepts and y intercepts ng given functions. So we have here examples. Letter A, f of x is equal to x plus 8 all over x minus 2. Okay? So papalitan muna natin si f of x ng y. That is y is equal to x plus 8 all over x minus 2. And then, to solve for x, so to solve for x, or for x-intercept, we will going to substitute 0 in y, and then solve for the value of x. Or, let y equal to 0. So yung ating function is, y is equal to x plus 8 all over x minus 2. So, we will going to substitute the value or 0 in y. So, that is 0 equals x plus 8 all over x minus 2. And then, we can do the cross multiplication or you can multiply the LCD x minus 2 on both sides. Okay, so this time we will going to cross multiply or cross multiplication. So 0 multiplied by x minus 2 is 0. So 0 is equal to x plus 8. Okay, and then separate natin yung variable sa number or yung constant sa variable. So we have negative x is equal to 8 and then multiply multiply both sides by negative 1 para magiging positive yung x natin. So this is positive x is equal to negative 8. Negative 1 times 8 is negative 8. So this is our x intercept at negative 8. Okay, next, to solve for y-intercept naman. So, to solve for y-intercept, we will going to substitute 0 to x. Okay, or let, let x is equal to 0 and then solve for y. Okay. So, yung ating function is y is equal to okay, x plus 8. So, the value x is 0. Let x equal to 0. So, 0 plus 8 all over 0 minus 2. So, we have y is equal to 0 plus 8 is 8 and 0 minus 2 is negative 2 or yung final answer natin is negative 4 8 divided by negative 2 is negative 4 so this is our y intercept at negative 4 okay so for letter b we have f of x is equal to x squared minus 5 x plus 6 all over x squared minus 2 x plus 3 okay so we will Going to change muna yung f of x into y. And then copy natin x squared minus 5x plus 6 all over x squared minus 2x plus 3. So to solve for x intercept. To solve for x intercept. So let y equal to 0. Let y equals 0. Okay, so yung ating y is 0. So 0 is equal to x squared minus 5x plus 6 all over x squared minus 2x plus 3. Okay, so next step. Copy muna yung 0 sa left side natin. 
So, 0 is equal to, and then pwede natin ma-factor out yung x squared minus 5x plus 6. Okay, so yung factor ng x squared minus 5x plus 6 is x minus 3, x minus 3 times x minus 2. Okay, so negative 3 times negative 2 is positive 6 and negative 3 minus 2 is negative 5. Okay, and then all over Okay, copy lang natin yung ating denominator x squared minus 2x plus 3 So, x squared minus 2x plus 3 And then, by cross multiplication So, any number multiplied to 0, the answer is 0 Okay 0 times x squared minus 2x plus 3 is 0 So, we have 0 equals x minus 3 times x minus 2 and then by the zero product property we have x minus 3 is equal to 0 and then yung next na then will be x minus 2 is equal to 0 and then the final answer we have x is equal to positive 3 and x is equal to positive 2 so we have we have two intercepts for x okay x is equal to 3 and x is equal to 2 and then for the y intercept so to solve for y intercept okay so ganun pa rin yung method natin to solve for y intercept let x is equal to 0 okay so we have y is equal to and then yung x natin magiging 0 so that is 0 squared minus 5 times 0 plus 6 all over 0 squared minus 2 times 0 plus plus 3 okay so 0 times 0 is 0 and then any number multiplied by to 0 the answer is 0 so we have 6 over 3 okay y is equal to 6 over 3 or 2 so our y intercept is y equals 2 okay next example letter c f of x is equal to x squared plus 9 all over x squared minus 3 okay change f of x into y so y is equal to x squared plus 9 all over x squared minus 3 okay so to solve for x let y equals 0 so for x intercept okay, let y equals 0 okay so we have 0 equals x squared plus 9 all over x squared minus 3 okay next we can do the cross multiplication so we have 0 times x squared minus 3 is 0 equals copy natin yung numerator x squared plus 9 and then Isolate variables from numbers. So we have 9 or negative 9 is equal to x squared. Or better in x squared equals negative 9. And then 
get the square root of of negative 9 and by the way wala tayong negative square root okay so there is no real solution for x squared plus 9 equals 0 so there is no x intercept because we don't have we don't have a square root of a negative number no x intercept